morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Um, bittersweet Friday for me because it's the last Friday of my kids' spring break, which means back to reality on Monday. Actually, back to reality uh, tomorrow because my oldest son is taking the SAT again, which means he's got to get up early, which means we're all getting up early to make sure he gets out the door and gets to where he needs to be. Um, I just wanted to pop in on real quickly and address uh, a request I get a lot, which is parenting advice. And I have been reluctant to do a video on parenting advice for a lot of reasons. One, I think a subject that is touchier than politics or religion is parenting and how to raise your children. So um, anything I say, someone's going to get offended, no matter what I do. And um, also because I'm not done raising mine. Um, they're almost 14 and 17, but really they're not fully formed people yet. So who am I to say, here's how to do it? because for all I know, I've raised two serial killers. I don't think I have. I'm pretty confident they're gonna turn out to be wonderful people, but I just, I don't know. I, I really don't feel comfortable saying, hey, this is how you should do it, because it worked for me. It's working so far, but. And then um, yet another reason why I haven't done a parenting video is because everybody is different. So what works for me and my husband and our little family is not gonna work for you and your family necessarily because you're not us. And what's working for you guys isn't gonna work because we're not you. I hate to make it sound so shallow, but the reality is it's like asking me for my hair formula, for the color for my hair, because the mixture that my colorist mixes up works with my body chemistry and my natural hair color, which God only knows what that actually is, and that's how I get the color that I get. We're not starting from the same base, so it's never gonna work the same on you. Had to tie in beauty somehow, right? Anyway, so that's why I pretty much haven't given, that's all the reasons why I have not done a parenting video yet. Um, I can tell you things I've done that have worked for us, and I really feel like a lot of parenting success is completely based on the attitude of the parents. And um, maybe I'll just slip some tips in, like, very, I don't know if I wanna do a whole video dedicated to parenting. I feel like, it's like ra waving a red flag at a bull. It's just people are gonna go crazy and think I'm being holier than thou and lecturing and blah, blah, blah. So that's where my reluctance comes in. Anyway, I'd love to get your feedback on that. I'm gonna, I just did my makeup. I used the Wet n Wild palette again. I'm really enjoying this little palette. And I contoured with the Hourglass Ambient palette. Oh, I put it away already. I um, copied a tutorial that Christina from Pretty Shiny Sparkly put up recently on a red carpet Oscar look. Um, I didn't do a bold red lip, but she was contouring with the Hourglass Radiant Light, and it I like it. It's subtle, and it's... I like it. I like it a lot. Thanks, Christina, for doing that. Anyway, um, so I'm going to do my nails, dry my hair, and then get on with the day. So I will check in with you later. Hey, guys. Uh, I'm on my way to Target with Sun One. Uh, we are going to pick up a new calculator that he needs for the SAT tomorrow and also just because both kids need it for um, all their math studies from here on in so we can keep it at home and they can share it. We've misplaced the original one. I'm not going to speculate as to where it is. And I say we but it's that one misplaced it. Anyway, um, I didn't do my hair today so this is what it looks like blown out with like absolutely nothing done to it. All right, here's the, we tried opening it. It's like Fort Knox. This is the famous, ridiculously overpriced, but cool color display. You know, that was on your Hanukkah list. Yeah, a new, a new calculator. That's really unbelievable. All right, we're Maybe gonna try to get that thing home and it. don't even joke. I'm kidding. Ay, ay, ay. I think we need to get that home and get a scissors on that. I could get it. Let's not mess with the $150 calculator. Okay, okay, let's get it home. Hey guys, I am. I have my camera propped up on my drinking glass. I am about to do my nails, and these are acrylics. And um, I have my Zoya nail polish. What is it called? Remove Plus nail polish remover called Three in One Formula Remove Plus. Best thing Zoya ever made. And I use these hands down ultra. What I like is you see it has this little fold up paper backing. You hold on to that and you don't get the polish all over your fingers. Anyway, I take the nail polish off, then I'm going to, I don't need a base coat because these are acrylics, and uh, I'm using this, and then I follow up with Sesh Top Coat, 
And that is the extent of my manicuring experience at home. Hey guys, I think I'm gonna end this vlog, vlog, vlog. Here, I am making dinner, salmon patties, fish is brain food, and my, like I mentioned earlier, my oldest son's taking the SAT tomorrow, so give him a little brain food. Um, one last tip before I go, if you're making patties of any kind, be they hamburger, salmon, turkey burgers, what have you, a trick I recently learned, many of you probably already know this, but I thought I'd pass it along, is make the patties and then stick them in the refrigerator for about 30 minutes, get them good and cold, and then fry them up. They will um, not fall apart in the pan quite so easily. So um, anyway, I'm gonna go make some mashed potatoes and salad and call it a night. And I will see you as always for the month of March tomorrow. Bye. So mammogram, check. Um, it took like 15 minutes. I don't know what the whining is about. I mean, honestly, it's not uncomfortable. It doesn't hurt. It's quick.